Kentucky's goal to build a statewide broadband network is still a go. Today, the governor and Congressman Hal Rogers met to update Kentuckians on the progress. Our Andrea Walker breaks down the updates. Today, Governor Matt Bevin admitted that the Kentucky Wired project is running slightly behind schedule, but he assured the crowd gathered here at the Capitol that the project has the full support of his administration and it will be completed. Unfortunately, Kentucky ranks 47th in the country in broadband speeds and capacity, which is why Governor Bevin and Congressman Hal Rogers are so passionate about the Kentucky Wired project, a statewide fiber optic network which will deliver reliable and affordable internet to communities across the state. Both men believe the project can transform the state with an emphasis on rural communities in eastern Kentucky. This is historic. It's big. It's complicated. But it can mean the difference to the economy of this state. These are the types of things that we are putting in place to ensure that Kentucky is the preeminent center of excellence for engineering, for manufacturing, for service, for logistics and distribution. This is something that we are going to be to an even greater degree than we are now. Kentucky will be the hub of excellence for America on this front. It cannot happen without broadband. Now the project was originally supposed to be completed by the fall of 2018, but they're running about four to six months behind schedule. They're now hoping to get things done between March and June of 2019. In Frankfurt, Andrea Walker, WKYT. The project comes with a price tag of more than $300 million. It's being financed by state and federal grants with the majority of those funds coming from private sector partners.